Hi there, Pisces. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're here for you. This is your November reading. Well, let's jump in. We're going to be taking a look at all matters of life, love, career, however spirit wants to bring messages forward here for you, dear Pisces. Now, wow, you have a lot coming through. You have a lot of people I'm hearing as well that will be watching you at this time, Pisces. This is going to be an emotional month. I'm getting specifically, okay, spirit wants to jump right into it. So, Let's not lose time. Pisces, I feel like somebody here has their eye on you. Okay, this is just coming through. I feel like you have your eye on this person too. Some of you, this is someone who you have been thinking about. Some of you, something about a car purchase. Either this person may be thinking about purchasing a car or you may be thinking about purchasing a car. I see something... Um, for some of you coming coming through in relation to this conversation, um, this is maybe a way that spirit can sort of let you know who we're, who it is that we're talking about. Let's get into it for the Pisces, the full moon of Pisces. Whoa, as a card coming through for you, the no, first card in and of itself. Okay, and then we have the first quarter moon in Virgo, assess the situation. We have first quarter moon in Scorpio in reverse, release your blocks. And then we have the full moon in Leo, go wild. Pisces as well coming through with the new moon in Pisces. You pulled the new moon and the full moon in Pisces or something. Uh, amazing here happening. Now, I am getting that, let's say it like this. Okay, let's back it up. There is someone here who's watching you, Pisces. I, I, this is the first thing that's coming through. So I do see that this person, you know, is that for some of you, wow, I'm hearing that you're the one, that you're the one that they want to be with. Okay, this person is not questioning that. Now, I see a, a car here. It's like a taxi cab with a little sort of like advertisement on the top of it. And I, that came from another reading. I remember saying, mentioning... This makes me think of New York. So, yeah, there could be something about New York. Maybe this person is from New York. Again, we just mentioned a car, something about a car. Maybe you met this person. Maybe they're an Uber driver. Maybe they are. I'm hearing they're a Leo for some of you. Something about Leo. Now, this person is thinking about you, Pisces, and it can even be matters of finances and career. Please watch your Midham and Angle sign for matters of career. Um, apply it, right? If you're like, well, I'm happily married is what it is. You know, well, hey, okay, someone's thinking about you. Moises, okay, and I feel like for some of you, this is someone that you've known for years. Um, I want to get a little bit further on who this is. This person wants to be really loving towards you. Uh, there may be a history here, you know, where things didn't go the way that you expected, the way that they expected, and maybe it's a matter of, yeah, I'm hearing it's a matter of time. I'm hearing it's about time that we have closure. So um, it may be that whoever this is, wants to even get something off of their chest with you, wants to finally admit something, feels that, you know, it's like there's no, I'm hearing, there's, I'm hearing, um, I'm hearing that song by Aerosmith, and I don't want to miss a thing, because even when I dream of you, so me that you may even bump into this person, um, let's continue, first quarter moon in Aquarius, trust the universe, now, I'm hearing, it's been a long day without you, my friend. Da, 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 some of you played the piano with this person, something about um, you know, music, or you or you did a project with this person, it was creative. It could be photography, video, Newman, Sagittarius. This person moves you, okay? They, they stir your spirit. Let's get further. You know, maybe this person disappeared uh, and you really like them, but you're like, what happened? You know, um, can be for some, it can be. For some of you, this person, you know, when you met them, they weren't ready for you, okay? They weren't ready. They, uh, for some of you, they may have even had, let's say, some something was going on. Can we get um, from the essential oil deck? And then we're going to eventually get a card for each of the days for November. Somebody here may have a pet. Okay. Grounding. Wow. I am somewhere... It's funny because we pulled so much Pisces energy. It says rooted. Grounding. I am somewhere else. Trigger statement. I'm seeing Dorothy in the Wizard of Oz right there. True statement. And by the way, I'm a channeler, star state oracle medium. We didn't mention in the beginning of the video. Usually we do. So if you're curious, I'm also Pisces. But okay, uh, right here, right now, everything is perfect. Allow your energy to shift the material plane to the material plane where it is needed to help you complete what you have set out to do. Like I'm saying, you uh, for some of you, you know something here. And I was getting that as I was meditating heavily coming through that. You've already kind of made your decision even. And um, for some of you, maybe it's in the sense of, I know who this is to me. I know that this person is going to be significant in my life one way or another. Now, for some of you, this person hasn't left you, Pisces. Okay, it's important to know now. Because I feel like there is a 3D to this experience and then there is a five there is a 5d and and, and, uh, and other d other d's and 1d 
basically is is what it, it leads to one direction okay everything leading to one sort of bottleneck moment in the portal and you know it's it's, it's got it's inevitable yeah some of you this person you guys um this person feels magnetically drawn to you your story and it's like i see that you guys have not left each other it's funny because this car is making circles <laughs> around the roundabout here so mm, repellent it's that car with the the taxi with the the sign on top detoxification monthly and repellent says shielded i'm under attack trigger statement true statement i am strong you will clearly see what you are taking on from outside influences and release your energetic boundaries are fortified repellent coming through Wow. Um, I will never change trigger statement. Some of you, you know, there was a give and take to the situation. I feel on one hand, you were like, I'm never going to see this person again. That's it. Like, I feel like you were convinced Pisces. And then I see this shifting moment. I'm seeing a wolf here. Um, you may have a very strong ancestry with this person. Very, let's, let, let, let's clear it. Yeah. But there is a lot of, you know, there's a lot to this. Okay. But let's get further. Detoxification. Let's clear and take on the root. Yeah. This person for some of you is, is, is really missing you like badly i feel like they feel that is almost like they they you know there's a saying in farsi it's like when you say i love you it's like you say like you're my limer my liver <laughs> my limer my, my lemur okay maybe you guys had a nickname okay i don't know take it as you look could be a message for somebody um possibly but yeah i see for some of you yeah. no they they want to tell you they want to let you know somehow that mirroring somewhere out there that that you're important to them and and, and and that they don't see okay the end so we're gonna get further we'll see what's what clary sage insight trigger statement there is no hope true statement there is a higher purpose connect with your higher self and allow to be guided to your higher purpose as the veil of illusion falls away you will find your answer i'm getting here that this is a big question of faith of trusting also your your story i hear it like this the one that you tell pisces then we have black spruce coming through for you restore let's clear it, it the trigger statement is i'm broken true statement i'm illuminated let's clear it. let's back it up clear the sacral on the root let's clear in the crown we have elevate receptivity we have gratitude and we have freedom so this is um something that i feel you know, there is a mirroring with what you're going through and what whoever this is who's coming through is going through. I'm seeing um, uh, I'm seeing something very challenging. Okay, and, and it's because there is a lot of also for some, I'm not going to lie. This is a spiritually controversial relationship. Even we're going to say it like that because, well, you know, there are a lot of uh, I'm hearing deities that, that that ride on this conversation that you have, but in a very particular way. Okay, it's like, yeah, they don't want you guys just together. If you know what I'm saying, we have here oregano resonance, and wow, and then we have spikenard faith. So, some of you, you know who this is to you, and as I was meditating, I was seeing that. This person knows who you are as well. You both know each other. There's no really questioning that. But the, the approach, it's, it is it is the approach. So I want to get here a little bit more on some sign placements. Okay, and then we're going to get a little bit further. It's going to be a long one, Pisces. Pisces coming through right there. Damn. And we have the new moon, full moon, Pisces cards. Whoa, Virgo. And then we have Mercury. Communication is the issue here. It has been, okay, and it can be for lifetimes. Uh, Sagittarius Leo, what does that mean? Well, you guys could be in love, you could have an amazing connection, and then you guys fail to publicize it. What does that mean? Ah, you don't have to go and become a famous couple and become a public couple and, you know, you call up on the paparazzi, it's like, hey, check us out. No, 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 I mean, pop, to go public with it, to be, to be, to be so rooted in your conversation of the heart to heart, okay, that, that you can have, the, you can have, Okay, the the beat of it. Okay, as as your mantra that you that you speak that you speak about that you speak through, and I'm seeing it almost like you know the, the willingness to share what you love about this person, the things that you feel for this person with others. So this is about activating the throat chakra and the heart chakra, Pisces and the crown. For some, there's something that you know you have to be willing to to say, right, to talk about, and that could be this person as well, Mars and Sag in some way, of course, right? It is mirrored. We have Leo, Sag, Mars. This person really feels sad. I feel um, because when they not when they're not brave about this relationship because they know that it doesn't just end here but that they're ending it prematurely let's get here a little bit further 
It feels kind of like uh, reckless almost. Mm -hmm. Aquarius 11. Wow, Neptune. Wow, a lot of Aquarius and Pisces. Somebody may even be on the cusp. Let's quit. Don't say And the second group. Yeah, so for some of you, I do see that this relationship has ended. Some of you, you ended this relationship even. And um, yeah, so I keep seeing some of you in a car. We have Pluto and the number nine. So let's get a little bit further on... Um, who we're dealing with here, Pisces? Who who is Pisces here dealing with? Who is Pisces here dealing with? Who is Pisces dealing with here? I'm seeing a white car. Jupiter and Gemini. Maybe this person works with cars. Maybe they are a car sales rep. For example, Ju Mercury and Capricorn. This person has had an eye on you. Has had their eye on you. I don't care how far they are. Okay. Um, there's a song. Uh, you could put an ocean between a love of, yeah. It won't tear us apart, yeah. This person could be far. They could be in another country. They haven't, they haven't lost touch with your, with, with, with your shape. I'm hearing that, ah. Uh, some of you, yeah, I feel like you, you, you play, you play, you play them, really. You do, you, the memory of you is, is, is something, um, of a book that, that, that they, that they can't, they can't open, but, but, they read through every night. I hear it like this. Sun in Aries. Okay. Venus in Virgo. Wouldn't they fall asleep? I, I, yeah. Jupiter. This person um, has something that they are not accepting though. And this is the issue here, right? This is the karma for some of you. Is this conversation that they're having maybe in a, in a, in a space that feels dual to what it is that they feel for you. It's almost like I see someone having two, two lives. Okay. Paralleling one another. Mercury and Capricorn, they could be for some of you something about maybe they are a public figure or maybe something cultural or yeah, it could be something even about family, family expectations. Maybe their family wants them to marry someone very, very particular. Maybe they have a prearranged marriage already. Maybe for some of you, for example, maybe they're religious. Okay, let's continue now. But I repeat, you know who this is, and they do too. And that's the part that is very interesting because then it's like, well, we know the answer to the test and we're, we're going to pretend like we are failing it. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, it's kind of like, at what point do we do we stop this game? Okay, and give, give in to... I'm hearing Leo, the Leo, huh? And someone, yeah, no, no, no. They really, they want to, they want to bring you back in. They want, but uh, for some of you, I'm seeing a motorcycle here. This person really thinking about what the best way is to approach you. Let's get a little bit further. Let's get a little bit further. I'm seeing someone here wearing a red robe. A red robe. Some of you, they're thinking about some kind of offer here. It may involve a, a vacation. I see someone wearing a jacket with a button down. It's very spiffy looking. Very, very spiffy. I see something like a London, something London. The style's looking London. London, uh, I don't know. What is, what is London style? But yeah, I'm seeing like a dapper look. You know, it's like in the old, old London look even. Kind of like, um, yeah, old school. Like a, I see, let's go, what is old school? It's always relative. Let's get a little further here, Pisces. Last quarter moon, such a chair practice gratitude. You both know what this is. For some, the last quarter moon in Gemini, clear your mind. And then we have full moon of Pisces, forgive. I see that for some of you, this is even a family member. Okay, this is a matter of allowing the healing to take place as well. Full moon in Sagittarius, see the bigger picture. And then we have here, new moon in Leo, shine. Uh, okay, so this is going to happen. I hear it like this, like no matter what, okay, even if we're still holding on to fear, however, this is going to happen. This is what I'm hearing from your guys. This is what I'm hearing from you. It's like, maybe you're saying, well, someone's going to take us out of this. Okay, somebody wants this bad enough to put whatever they felt was, was more important on the line. Okay, so so let's see let's see what's what. And this is going to resonate over time. Please come back to this video because it is a general video as well. One to two. Um wait the timing of the downloads. But uh it's in about a year, right? My my readings tend to have a very sort of particular um it's interesting the way that they 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 yeah um well and other readings may as well, but I've noticed with my reading specifically eleven month mark and really yeah, six to eleven, uh yeah, um a black Mustang here. This is your divine counterpart, Pisces, for some of you. Your royal couple in a past life, but let's clear it. Some of you, you, you told yourself, I know who they are. Again, it's not a question of was what. 
it's a matter of where they are willing to walk forward to. I see two people in a forest. It's like each one is calculating their steps. It's like they know they know how close they're getting. They know when they're when they're drawing farther away too. They, yeah, there's this sort of like watching the back energy. I'm seeing the number six on a bus passing by. That could be a very particular focus, very particular number. Yeah, this person, you guys, you will you will see this person. I see physically. If you are curious, if you're wondering, will I see them again physically? I'm hearing yes, but again, this is general video, and it's always a matter of shadow work as well. And this is also right. Yeah. Uh, uh, again, um, uh, a particular message um, that is up to you as well to see when it does resonate in what way. Maybe this month it's going to be more metaphorical. Maybe next month it'll be more literal. Maybe in six months it'll be both. <laughs> okay, at the same time, and then there's going to be this combustion, and it's going to have a whole other meaning that more, 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 um, you know, even existentially. Okay, let's continue. So no third party involved coming through. Okay, for some of you, this person really left you with a really awful taste in your mouth. Okay, it's one of those moments where even something really kind of came off in a certain way that just broke your heart for some of for some of you, and I feel like they felt that they knew that they knew that what they left you with was 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 dishonest as well, possibly to the truth. For some of you, this person, yeah, I'm, I'm can't wait to work with the tarot on this because yeah, I want to get further into their character. They may be a little bit young. That this this person may their love language may be to tease you, to taunt you. Okay, possibly. I see a motorcycle here again, and I see um. Mm -hmm. I see, uh, I see some sort of, um, I see something about a sheriff here. Uh, the interesting part is that they may have a job that requires of them to be very sort of, I'm hearing tucked in at the, at the, at the seams. Okay. So, so, so very, very also sort of professional maybe you know and it was very misleading because it's like this person is so mature in some ways okay they got their shit together they got their job together they seem like they're, they're very hard worker they, but then no no but i'm hey pisces sorry about that the phone cut hopefully it'll let us record for a little while longer um let's continue uh upside down yeah okay so can, reconciliation uh yeah we were saying um i don't remember <laughs> okay, the, the thought just, yep, yeah, right, straight over the head. Um, yeah, they're very mature, but they may come off in a very mature way, right, right. But then uh, then you meet them and you're just like, what? It's like a video game. That's, that's what we said when the phone cut. Um, the way they behave in, in, emotionally is like, it's almost, it starts to become erratic. Like, a real, you can just feel, you can tell that this person is not feeling comfortable. Uh, it's almost like, yeah, um, someone who, you know, it, it's like you, you feel that, that they're so comfortable as if, you know, the relationship is that, or even your work relationship, your professional connection is that they're in their own house. But then when it comes to emotional matters, when it comes to emotional matters, it's as if they want to leave their house, <laughs> okay, because they no longer feel comfortable. No, the bed doesn't work for me anymore. Actually, yeah, no, no, but you stay here. That reminds me of the Libra reading. <laughs> from about a year ago it was last april was it yeah um someone with the donkey milk the title of that video i believe is someone left you on the corner of the saddest so, so, someone left you on the saddest corner and they're ready to pick you up now okay that's interesting because we're talking about a car here in this video so you may be dealing with a libra uh sun and rising venus mars okay let's get further let's back it up even in midhaven i'm hearing that people underestimate the midhaven okay i'm seeing a dodge maybe this person likes race cars i see a cadillac here as well Okay, now let's get further. Something about family. I feel like they're very intimidated about you. Now we have more than one chord coming through. This is a deck that I've created, by the way. Just um, these are messages here, channel messages. Let's uh, go particular messages yeah if i see as well you're very studious or you're very impressive with something that you're doing in your in your story i feel like you're very complimentary in the sense maybe you're very good at something and then this really triggers this person whatever you're really good at really triggers this person it's like they feel like they don't know like the what, what you know about, and, and so this is the type of person to kind of shut down okay when when they're feeling that way so we have your content more than one chord we have not often now i do also gather this person very jealous um, whether or not that they have expressed that side to you, they're extremely jealous, okay, about certain things that they may be seeing on your social media, and I see that that's really heavily triggering them and, and, and kind of provoking their behavior. So whatever they're doing, their behavior, the way they're acting, okay, it's erratic, you're feeling like it's like different from one day to the next, they're, um, they're not comfortable with something that they're seeing, maybe I'm um, hearing specifically on your stories. Is that on Facebook or Instagram or however, whatever it is? Now let's continue. It says, yes wants to reconcile, we have a double reconciliation card. We have, I really miss you. 
and I read that kind of as need. This person doesn't want to feel that they need you, though. That's very, very uh, awkward to them. Like, yeah, this person, I feel, is used to being more of an emperor type. Again, we're going to pull, yeah, it's tarot to, mm. We have family coming through. Yeah, some, some of you maybe come from, like, a wealthy family, or there's something with your family, maybe. They don't know. I keep seeing a Mustang here. I see a blue Mustang here, okay? Not your social media. Maybe they're, like, even intimidated by silly stuff like your car or something. If, if this, yeah, like the car you drive or, you know, how big the parking lot is even, in, yeah, around your house. What? Okay, so... <laughs> It's something, yeah, maybe it's a, they feel that they don't, they are, some of you live in a gated community and they're like intimidated. Okay, like it says not your social media and then balance Queen of Cups. So also the fact that your healing is, 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 you know, they're impressed by you and I feel like, yeah, they don't want to, they don't want to talk to you, period. I see that this person has ended it. At least the more vulnerable side of the connection. And the energies I see them wanting to close that down for some of you because not because of what they feel okay it's, it's they feel very very much for you okay I see this person wearing pinstripe outfits could be um, also past life energy it, this is more the semantics of how they can actually I'm hearing grow the seeds with you it's like they're not feeling comfortable okay grow, potting the plants together because they know that you're bringing the sunshine you have the seed as well okay the, the seed the seed of the idea to begin with and maybe even that is uncomfortable to them. You must be dealing with someone who's got a very strong ego right now at play here. Okay, yeah. Somebody here drives a Prius. I'm seeing something about a Prius. For some of you, I'm hearing a Honda Civic. Um, it's like someone here drives a Maserati. I'm seeing as well. For some, I'm hearing uh, oh oh the spider car. What is that? It's like I'm hearing Acura as well. There's something that uh, really is it Toyota Acura. They're not comfortable. I see a white fluffy dog. Like they they um <laughs> I'm seeing something about Spider Man. They don't know what to offer you, Pisces. I hear it like that. No, let's continue. Third person other than this querent family. This is a this is for some of you, they're making an excuse. For some of you, I see a school bus, they ran off, maybe even to another country. Okay, now this is important. It's not like, oh no, like we're supposed to be together and like no 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 no. <laughs> this was meant to happen. They have to do that. Are they, if they're gonna be so afraid to commit to their own heart space, they better leave. Okay, they better they better go back. Okay, home country, planet. Plan okay, we'll come back in the next lifetime and maybe we'll we'll see each other. Yeah, I'm here. It's been a long day without you, my friend. Da -da -da -da. See you again. Uh, someone here is a poet. For some of you, you're very proficient in writing, speaking. This person may even sometimes swing, you know, they make it kind of, it's kind of, um, it's, it, they get frustrated with the fact that they don't know how to approach you as well. Uh, let's back it up with throat. And it's strange because then I see that there's this anim animosity or this antagonistic energy as well that um, comes in between you two. So yeah, it's kind of a shame. It's something that um, is, is kind of like not the point, but then it starts to become uh, kind of even like, Hey, Pisces, the phone cut there again. Um, yeah, so we're saying, um, then you start, guys start to get into these arguments that, um, and these discussions, and even, like, just your, the dynamic, it, it starts to sort of sag. It starts sagging a bit here. I, I see that something starts to, you lose the focus of the relationship, basically, okay? It's like you forget, you know, why we came together. It's like we start talking about, but this is because the tension and the passion I'm getting as well is is being diverted. So I see I see you guys acting more sort of even out of character. Um, like let me give an example. Maybe this person never felt so triggered, and then they start to act kind of strange with you, and then they're starting to associate you with how they're behaving. But that's not your problem, right? Okay, let's get further here. The finances and career was in reverse, so they may be working on their finances. Some of you you were sexing with this person, sexting coming through something sexual in reverse, no in reverse. This person was all mixed messages. We have something academic upright. For some of you, they they weren't sure that this was a even. So let's get a little further throat chakra. Oh. Let's get the tarot now, Pisces. Some of you have, like, beautiful. I see that. Uh, you have this sort of present. It's like, when you show, when you show your face, um, yeah, um, there's something that they, 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 they can't handle as well. It could be just, they're very turned on by you. Let's get further with the tarot it's clear mm -hmm. they're afraid to like look in your eyes for some of you they don't want to be seduced or they don't want to be caught looking at you i've seen that as well okay <laughs> especially if it's maybe the work environment okay this person maybe like a ceo you guys went to a buffet one time i think something about chinese food okay let's get <laughs> the fool 
We'll get further, but more erratic and dirty. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm seeing a ladder here. The Fool King Cups is person very emotional about you guys. They feel that, honestly, like, you're their future. Okay, for some of you, that they're freaking out because they ran away from this, and I see them, like, stopping and panting and knowing what the hell they're doing, but then they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't stop five pentacles. They cannot, for, they feel they cannot afford your love. Okay, that's what it comes, they don't feel that they afford, and that's sad to, to, to see. Okay, it, but it's something that they see right now. That's their perspective. Two of wands. That's what, that's what they see right now. Let's get further the sun. It's a huge shame because you guys are, are really, really very, very even similar. Ten of Cups. Okay. I feel this person may be projecting onto you that, like, you're creating this feeling, the feeling, or, like, that you in some way are, like, you know, causing them this trouble. Alligator. I feel this person left and they wanted to kind of make an issue yours at the end and just so that they would feel more comfortable about kind of trashing this conversation. Even Oh, dear. Trashing. Well, there was something that maybe was yeah they're fearful seven of pentacles for some of you they may be religious and they feel you're a taboo sorry not a problem you know it's like right i mean no not a problem like you may be a terror reader, you may be into spirituality okay maybe they're an atheist maybe they don't believe in you know so whatever the factor is okay i see that they don't want to admit it though i'm seeing a huge luggage here i feel this person is like kidding themselves okay well yeah i'm getting hardcore shrek vibes here for some they're kidding i'm seeing bank of america symbol they're getting they're this is they're they're messing they're messing with their own computation at this point okay because it's not, definitely not yours you guys i feel some of you here were you hurt by this oh my god you were hurt by this ten of swords okay this person maybe even like kind of ghosted at a certain point look at this ten of swords but you made peace with how, where they're at in their life and you said all right they're not ready it is fine they're not ready to see my light and yeah they're not ready to see, appreciate my light and they don't appreciate me and that's okay and and i see that you 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 said it to yourself in the mirror i know who i am and i'm not gonna let this person's projection define me now this person though the issue here is that you still feel them i see cameo they may be in the army for some of you in the navy uh, i see um cameo i'm hearing the desert in the desert lands i see something in, like saudi arabia for some of you i see some we're really hot um this person uh yeah 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 sand dunes something about sand okay um I'm hearing Haiti for some, Hades for some. Let's clear it. Some are very, very sunny. Now, this is so sad because I feel like you were like, but what was wrong with me? No, Pisces, don't go there. No, no, because it's not about that. But hey, if you want to go there, you know, you got maybe some more shadow work. Seven of Swords here, the Nine of Pentacles. And definitely, please, follow the yellow brick road of your fears and see where it leads you, right? I always say that. Um, you know, if you have a fear, follow, follow it. Okay, what's your fear? Okay, so, and then and then where does that lead? Where does that fear lead you? And get down to the seed of, yeah, this this also self-talk maybe. Let's go ahead and say one root. So maybe they're reflecting what it is that you are. In a way, maybe subconsciously telling yourself, right? If we come into contact with someone who's projecting an idea that is really, really hurtful to us, why are we in some way receptive to that frequency? We do let people into our story, right? And you are very conscious, Pisces, right, of on some plane, energetically, who it is that you're interacting with. So this is not random. This person is there to help guide you okay but i feel that you did for some of you have a really challenging time at a certain point with this with that ten of swords and the devil very hard i mean this was this was this was probably dark knight of the soul okay material with the devil and the ten of swords i mean you know very very hurtful now let's get a little bit further here seven of swords knight of cups okay i see that you you are very strong okay and 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 you know um you realize that there's always something there's a silver lining okay and there's a there's a meaning and there's a reason for why yeah you met this person and in some ways you were like why did i even meet this person if they were going to do this to me if they were going to just run off then i mean why would i in the first place and but then you're realizing no no no, i can't think like that okay that would dismiss the fact that what i know that there's much more to life than just saying i'm here also i'm sorry i have to understand what this is and so maybe some of you this person was holding something out with you maybe yeah so um and i see that you really wow have elevated we did we almost say evelyn i'm hearing michelle branch here okay interesting six of cups the empress maybe someone really likes michelle branch page of some of you are an aspiring uh musician when the feeling's right da -da 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 -da. When the, da -da -da, the one oh what a night two pentacles you're getting fit you have a turnaround here so now the point being right this person it has not cannot forget you okay and they're actively thinking about how to integrate the conversation now this is a general video right if you're dealing with someone and you want to have absolutely nothing to do with this person please subscribe to that continue to subscribe to that belief that 
you don't accept this this maybe even apology is your point you know maybe that's not what it's about but just know that this person is you know even like for some of you it's like the, the kind of vibe of i've saved up like now i'm ready you know this may resonate in about a year pisces save this would do playlist come back to it it was one year before coronavirus went public i was channeling i'll never forget it in in in, in um the Pisces and new moon, full moon season, and it was a May 2019 reading, I believe 2019 or 2018. Anyways, um, channeling and uh, and in that video, I was hearing it was a long reading. It was about an hour or so, two hours, um, and I was hearing keep clear of Corona. And I told the viewers, I don't know what that, I don't know what that's alluding to, but I'm hearing that. And I was so be it. Uh, and uh, a year later, okay, approximately 11 months or so, rather, someone came back to that video and commented on the bottom of it. They were like, "This is not just beer, <laughs> okay?" Because I was like, you "Guys, maybe you want to keep clear of Corona, you know? Don't maybe don't be drinking so much." Just like, no, okay. And that came through in three or four readings. It was sprinkled throughout that period, and so it's funny because Pisces just rule. Uh, yeah, anyways, um, it's all very interesting. Okay, so in, the point is, come back to readings, and they will resonate in different ways at different times. Now, let's get further. Page of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles. For some of you, mm -hmm, this person is coming back. I don't, you may not be receptive, but I'm, yeah, I'm seeing that this person does want to know something about you. So they may be testing the water. They may even be talking to someone here. For some of you, they, they believe that they have a, a chance with you. So if you feel that, yeah, if you would know that this person, you know, knows that let's say it's a no-no i don't this may not even be yeah the, the message with that person it may be a, a message with someone else sometimes yeah it may resonate in a different capacity with the lovers because i feel that this person feels you guys have another shot at it eight of wands yeah they're thinking of approaching you they're they're like really close for some of you and for some of you um especially if they've been saving up or doing something with their finances they're king of pentacles the tower and the four of swords yeah yeah you guys for some of you you gave this person a taste of their own medicine some of you you ghosted this person back some of you yeah and i see you just getting on that empress train like you doing you okay and this is really kind of in a way though actually inspiring this person so if you were hoping that it would get that get get back of them it's actually inspiring them which is interesting which is healthy it tells me that you both are encouraging each other and in, 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 uh, in, to train to yeah mm-hmm to to tr to transition into another form of, of 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 how you relate to one another in this dimension because now is the time of ascension so everything is changing and transforming it's important to shed those layers and you guys are triggering each other i believe to do that and this is a relationship the way you'll know what this is is that you you have changed so much through this the devil the ten of swords and the seven of swords i mean you would not feel those energies if there wasn't something that that needed to be purged let's get further Knight of Swords. That's why some people you're like, why does that person just get me? Right. They have they have a they have a clue as to what it is that you want to talk about again. Okay. To to say again to yourself. Okay. And oh, that's why we're all teachers. To, yeah. Everyone is a teacher to one another in this dimension. Knight of Swords, Ace of Pentacles. Can you tell me more spirit about this King of Pentacles coming through for Pisces in their third week? I'm hearing Akron. Is that in Ohio? Akron, Ohio. Okay, Akron, Ohio. Interesting. Yeah, the Emperor. Yep. Some of you, there may have been a third party. There may have been, though, also this... This is someone who is more like a man's man. What is the phrase? Like, they don't... You know, I'm going to say it like this. The way that they're treating you, they're treating others like that way. If you know that this person is treating other women or other girls, okay, in a different way than how they're treating you... I'm not talking guys. They will. This is the type of person who will be way more comfortable around guys than they are around girls, for example. Um, but if you know that this person is, for example, like giving different treatment to like certain women, okay, or girls, and not you, um, or or treating you differently, then that is. This is not your person. I hear like this. This is someone that is. This a, that there's a they're a man's man, okay. And the issue they have is with the feminine archetype. It's not with you know something about you in particular. I feel even if you let's say didn't have a taboo, okay, about your about your conversation the queen of pentacles in reverse and the taboo can be that you're a high level functioning light worker period doesn't mean that you're a tarot card reader doesn't necessarily what is tarot card reading right it's channeling right as well um in some cases right okay but let's continue yeah it depends queen of pentacles in reverse ten of wands of right it's a medium okay you can use rocks and channel and do you know what you need to do ten of wands here right when it comes to um you know your discussion but you don't need to do right it as well and that's the, the, the thing about yeah the tarot at least with me okay is 
since I started, it's all channeling. <laughs> and um, so it's it's not like, let's say, the Ten of Wands. For the, it's the energy that is associated. And I know many readers, they, they read like that. So, um, but uh, yeah, th this is a matter of the, yeah. So this is what it comes down to. It boils down to the fact that they cannot live with you and they also cannot live without you. So could we get a little bit further? For some of you, this person really likes video games. You have the two of swords. There is, they're trying to manifest you actively here, I see. And there's also an issue for some of you of culture and language. We have the eight of cups at the base of the queen of cups in reverse. They feel really bad about something. So could we get a little bit more on that king of pentacles? Could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But yeah, the channeling is, it's the flow. You know, technically the king, yeah, okay, so rarely on King of Swords, yeah, this person didn't communicate with you the way they needed to, or they didn't communicate something very particular with you that they needed to. It may have been in relation to something sexual. It could be acknowledging what you guys experienced. With the Queen of Wands in reverse, you know, they, they really, I feel, let the ball go with the, with one very particular aspect of your connection with them. We have reconciliation, yeah. So they know for some of you that they maybe owe, owe an apology or that they need to come through and say this very particular thing that they didn't say. And I really feel for so many of you, it's eating this person up alive. So let's get further. I don't feel like you're really thinking about it as much as this person is thinking about it. Elevated Queen of Cups, and I do see them coming back. So it is what it is. I mean, for some of you, it's going to be a test. Do I really feel this person is in resonance with who I am now after I've moved through all my shadow work? Or is it over, you know, for now? It says this is not over in the theme, but please, guys, this is about your ascension, right? Which is about prioritizing your shadow work. If being in this relationship, okay, again, is going to make you feel like you are not being true and honest with what your weak spot is, is it knowing this person is not really for me? And then kind of allowing them back into my story? then you know and and not really getting really authentic with your higher self not that you don't feel something but what is the integration of this relationship what's the context of the connection is it actually serving you and your values let's clear let's back it up clear is it something that is actually addressing your values if not i mean don't don't take that right message because this is again yeah it says pull back your heart chakra energy this is about what feels right to you and maybe for many of you the message let's go someone here was very childish and i think if anything you're going to say i need more time before we can even talk okay let's get a little bit further three stores in the theme oh pisces no no you you do need really really to take time to like the card is saying as well preceding that pull back your heart energy maybe you're even telling this person or trying to subliminally communicate that hey maybe it's known it's like i know that we have connection but i'm not i need time okay so yes we're just confirming that if you need time take that time many of you you know you don't want to accept this person just when they return i'm hearing that as well so take the time you need like to really work through your your experience okay maybe the timing for you know when this person returns is horrible for you it's like horrible for you. Maybe, you know, you're even on a, in the middle of a conversation in another capacity. There's something not right about the timing maybe for you right now, right? So that doesn't mean that this person not good for you. Um, and if it is your true love, you shouldn't be worried about, you know, putting this person on the back burner because if it's meant to be, they will be there. Okay, I feel like this is for many of you a connection where you've realized that, that time and time again, this relationship withstands the test of time. We have Silver Dragon illuminates your potential with higher light. Some of you, though, you have a choice between several people. This came through another reading of yours. It was like two frogs are pursuing you. One wants to take you back to the pond. One has elevated. It illuminates your potential with higher light. It was the Mars retrograde reading, which will overlap in November. Accept untapped resources. Access, we said. Accept untapped resources. Look into your soul. See higher possibilities. Okay, and then we have here Magenta Dragon enables you to bring forward your soul wisdom, awaken your soul memories and higher spiritual understanding, prepare for accelerated ascension. You're fucking busy right now, Pisces, on a spiritual plane. Pardon my French, okay? Uh, you're you're very busy, Pisces. And many of you may not even have time for love, okay? And I feel like it's one of those moments where you're just not even in the mood. It's like, I can't even, like, understand, you know, I mean, are you being, are you being romantic now? It's like, maybe they're going to even write you a letter. It's very romantic, but you have your mind set on something else right now it could even be your career for some of you you're a, you're a mother i see that with the empress and the six of cups it could even be that this is the, the father of your child but maybe they, they left and you know in the middle of the conversation but i mean now you're not needing them like you were in the past as you were perceiving it i see another taxi here so yeah there's something about um travel even possibly let's get a little bit further And 
and then we'll close it out, Pisces. This person, um, something about the color gray. Some of you are in the limelight. Sun, Ten of Cups, yeah. Many of you. Um, spirit, yeah. Um, you have a responsibility here on, 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 yeah. Something about someone's aunt. You've got a responsibility, or maybe this even how they see you. So, again, apply it. If you're like, oh, I'm ready to accept this person back in my story. It may be that they're perceiving you as unapproachable or too busy for them now, you know, these days. Or you're looking too empress. You're looking too good for me, all right? It's like, and in that case, if that's going to be it, it's not like, oh, uh, should I dumb it down? Then maybe I shouldn't be the empress. No, you're not going to be you the empress, right? <laughs> if you're truly the empress, I mean, that wouldn't be a question. But, uh, right? I mean, yeah, the empress has gotten to the point where she's appreciating her empress. And that was a long journey, right? A long, long ride. But, um, you know, this person... Uh, if they're going to dismiss the potential of the connection because they are intimidated by the potential that you're pursuing with the connection that you have with yourself, with your higher self, this is not, this is not time for the connection, right? So let them step away. Let them not pursue you if they're not really ready. We don't want someone just, period. We want them to be embracing their power as well. Otherwise, that will lead to a host of issues, okay? Through the relationship, you're going to feel, I have to, like, brush his ego back, you know? And make it feel like, you know, he, yeah, it, it's it's all good. It's like, no, no, he's making, for some of you, also trouble in the relationship because he's feeling insecure. So that, oh, it's going to get very exhausting through the relationship. And Spirit is, no, 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 no. The Empress doesn't have time for that. She needs the Emperor upright. We have Emperor here upright. Come through right there. Temperance. This person, yeah, needs to prove it to you. So maybe this is something you will tell them. It's like, yeah, know who I am now. I hear it like this. Let's get a little bit further. You may tell them, yeah, know who I am now. This is my expectation. And you're just kind of saying it, but then you're not ex really entertaining an open dialogue. Okay, easily. Maybe, for example, when they text you, you're going to text back in maybe two weeks. In four weeks. It's like, I'm busy. Okay, I hear it like this. You know what I'm saying. So, or, yeah, it's like, um... I'm letting you know that this is where I'm at right now and I'm not open to a communication until maybe another month. Okay, maybe we'll chat in a month. So there's something like this for some of you. Um, you know, I mean, is this said with wet eyes? Maybe, okay. For some of you though, the point is, yeah, that um, you are, like that card said, pulling your heart energy back. Let's clear it, let's get further. Some of you are with your family, something very busy here, okay. Yeah. Now you're letting things happen on your time. You're letting the empress, okay, sit at home now instead of you going to their place every time. And going, you know what I'm saying? It's like, yeah, this is a matter of why don't we play on my court every now and then, okay? Yeah, we chose the ball together, but let's be fair with the court we play on as well. So, you know what I'm saying? Let's fit a, Let's get a ball that fits both of our hands. Okay, not one that's easier for you to grip, but not easy. Hey, Pisces, we're back. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, so it's a matter of kind of calling in the ideal version of the relationship that you see potential for rather than just sort of accepting what, it, you know what I'm saying? Let, allow and, and enc well, encouraging this relationship to actually elevate. So maybe in a last lifetime, this dynamic was appropriate, right? Always sort of meeting the emperor where he feels like the emperor without necessarily making sure, right, that you're the empress. I'm seeing a pack of cigarettes here. It could be a very beautiful message. I see a leather jacket. Somebody may be a smoker. I'm not sure. Let's clear the energy. Let's get here. Um, someone is a twin. For some of you, someone's a chef, okay? Or they really like um, something about barbecue. Um, for some of you, this is very particular. They do something with um, something with American, something something American. Uh, maybe like something about the holidays, hot dog. I see, I see something barbecuing around the holidays something very patriotic it's like maybe they have a company or a business that's related to fourth of july even okay let's get further let's get here um we did already say they may be in the army um okay it doesn't doesn't need to be let's get a little bit further pisces i'm hearing you know what you need to feel comfortable in this conversation in this connection okay you know what you need to feel comfortable in conversation feel comfortable and connected actually to this person right in a way, because you are able to, to connect. Okay. Um, because you're, you're, you're understanding yourself in that space. 
right? The relationship is about you and you as well, not just, yeah, and anyone who really, really loves you, Pisces, will wait for you to be ready. Okay, will. We want you to be with you first. You don't want half a human, even at that. Okay, you want a full mind, body, soul, right? And if that is, if you know all about my person, you're scared and you know it. They're not going to get to that point. Then that's the projection of the ideal we're, we're, we're presenting to them. And we're in a way coaching their victim mentality, right? It's like, why not? I mean, and if they are not going to elevate, why wouldn't you elevate? By releasing that vibration. Okay. Are you living for this person? That's the shadow Neptune. That's clear. So anyways, guys, right? It, sometimes it's challenging though, right? This is a, sh yeah, this is a shadow work message. Okay. Really important from spirit wants to underline, you know, when you know that as well, someone is not accepting their potential with themselves, then yeah, it's time to release. Let's get a little bit further. Who, uh, who is this person to Pisces? Who is this person to Pisces? Who is this person spirit to Pisces? Who is it? Some of the very social, the sun coming through. Wow. And the king of wands. Okay. For some of you, they're I see like a tawn, br brawny uh, kind of complexion. Um, even aura. There's something, um, this person may be tribal. Uh, okay, that's coming through. It could be also past life. Um, I'm seeing something kind of, there's some kind of glow to their aura. And it could be a fire sign for some. We did say strong Leo. We do have the sun. We got the emperor again. Okay. Wow. We have the sun depicted on the emperor card sheesh a lot of fire here this person um sometimes though gets in the king of pentacles they this person is a very much though in the space of like i need to be respected i need yeah but they know that that's oh that gets toxic it can it can and that it sabotages the relationship we have the death card and they know that you are the fleshy inside of the dragon fruit they don't want to be dealing with the spikes trust me i mean like that but they, they, yeah they in other words they you are their safety okay you are there that's how they see you you're their safe haven now that does not mean if this person is toxic that you need to bring them in oh i need to save them his safe space no no you are your safe space let's see it let's clear it i'm seeing some dark energy for some of you spirit is encouraging you to continue swimming okay you do you you see pisces this is like the sixth time the video has cut sorry about that it was a while um you didn't see it on playback but the phone wasn't charging i had to get a totally different charging set and uh long story kind of but uh, basically we're back okay <laughs> we're charging so yeah um let's clear it I'm getting here that there's a, some very important for you, while this is still, let's say, not so-called happening, to have a proper outlet to discharge, no pun intended, the energies that are building between you two, because the energy is still building, and I see that you guys are still having some sort of connection or conversation. Um, okay, this is for those who are feeling that they are still entertaining anything of the sort. Some of you have done cord cuttings, this is a different story. Um, the Emperor here, the King of Pentacles, King of Wands. Let's get a little bit further the Death card. Three of Pentacles, yeah. So this is something that I do see does have a new beginning. It is coming, but in the meantime, yeah, I feel like, let's go, I keep seeing a Prius. Uh, I'm hearing Havana, could be the Havana Sandals, or Havana Cuba, uh, for some. Somebody's a photographer or some photography. Um, I see someone with like a camera around their neck. They're always with their camera. Um, I see someone with a suit and tie, a blue, a blue, light blue shirt, button down, a light blue button down shirt with um, like a coat on and a darker, slightly darker shade of blue. Their tie is slightly darker. Now I'm hearing Slipstream. I'm hearing Sunset Park. I'm hearing Nuevo. Uh, okay. Well, okay, very specific. Let's get further. I think slipstream okay anyways let's continue now yeah because you're yeah very important um slipstream is a ca is a cafe um anyways in dc at least i don't know if they have different s spots around the world but um this person yeah they may who knows um i don't know if it, they definitely have multiple spots in dc but i don't know in other states for example um, anyways, that might be a message. This is very important that you have an outlet for the tension that you feel is building between you because this person is going to be, you're going to be picking up on a lot of this person energy. Let's clear. King of Cups. Page of Swords. The Devil. Let's get a little bit more here. Temperance. Okay, so I'm hearing again, you know who this is. 
some of you, you in the sense of you know the role they play in your story but for some of you the, last one, the role that they will play i'm here as well but for some of you this is like you literally know that maybe you're wondering do i already know this person is someone in the future i'm hearing you know this person take it as well somebody is an illustrator they do paint they, they do something uh, very creative or they're a lyricist for some of you now um let's get a few more cards here for each of the days and then we're out pisces I feel this person, Pisces, is really fantasizing about you. Okay, I'm, I'm having, like, visions of twin flames popping out. Yeah, I mean, are we surprised with coffee cup? For some of you, they're imagining you shirtless. What? Okay, oh, plus 18 in the title alert. Okay, the, the other imagining, you know, twin flames, coffee cup. I'm hearing the name Sergio. I'm hearing the letter S, Sergio. I'm hearing Sal Salerno. This is a place in Italy. Yeah, it's like a region, a city. Salerno. Okay, Twin Flames, Coffee Cup, Palm Tree, Butterfly. It's been a long time since I was in Italy, guys. Slash, even speaking Italian. <laughs> I'm like, probably sounding very foreigner right now. Twin Flames, Coffee Cup, P Palm Tree. What is it called, foreigner? I felt so at home in Italy, in Sicily specifically. Palm Tree, the Butterfly. Some of you may have traveled with this person. self indulgence could also be a passive energy. Okay, for some of you have uh, history, though. It's Pisces, it cut again. Oh my god, I think we're gonna have to cut this video short. It's just... The camera is just like won't won't so yeah for some of you you know let's clean the heart chakra so, or you guys will travel a lot when you finally do come together i see travel as an integral part of your connection i was hearing mesa is that in arizona somewhere um in a is something desert desert somewhere out in the desert i'm hearing tuscany for some of you tuscany italy now let's go further i'm hearing little neck i think that's in new york is it queens long island okay um Let's get a little further. I'm hearing the Federal Reserve. Somebody may work in the government. Okay, there's something that someone needs to. Okay, the runner is very interesting. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. This person will come out. They're gonna come out of the uh, of of the shadow space. Okay, this is what I'm in. in they're gonna reveal themselves to you. I see them writing a very clear letter. No alias. None of that. No little games, okay? No, I'm sort of here. I'm not peekaboo. No, no, none of that. I hear like this, and if you're getting something like that, this is not your person. That forget the frog. That's the frog. That's that's wanting to take you back to the pond. <laughs> okay, let's go to the third eye. Love and light, maybe not. Wow, you are. We literally have the chaser and the runner on top of one another, mirroring each other. Wow. And then we have here, and the first card out is twin flames. Okay, you lead with soulmate. So yeah, for some of you, one of you may be in a relationship right now, and it's going to really come down to how openly you can communicate about the reality of the situation, which is, I moved on, maybe for some of you. I'm sorry, but for some of you, it's like, I'm not able to really think of this right now, or or I'm not really able to think about this right now. I need time to think. Or I'm not open to this anymore. You know, sometimes, yeah, it's like, it's a bittersweet. Yeah, we have not today on not enough. Some of you, though, you, you know, you have a very strong connection. You have very high vibrational. I'm getting that again from your spirit guides. Mm-hmm. So in general, it's like, you're not going to question really. Like, you're like, I know it's not meant for us to talk now. Okay. Or this is just not the right time. I don't see you like fretting over this. Okay. Now I'm supposed to, this is, I'm really about to get really pissed off now. The, the video st keeps cutting. This is the last time I'm using my phone. Fuck the whole deck. Half of it. <laughs> we still have some working here. Okay. No, I don't give a shit, guys. This is the energy. I'm going to say it the way it is. Those of you new followers. Oh my God. Okay. This is the way it work. Okay, I channel the energy. So for some of you, there's a frustration. There's a goddamn tension here is what's going on between you and this person. This person, let me tell you, when you dismiss them, you may not pick up the phone call. You may not respond, respond or react in the way that you, you would in the past. This is something about Halloween. Okay. That will trigger this person, the bejesus out of this person. Like you've never seen, like you've never known. We have Douglas fur, we have tension literally just came out, guys. And we were talking about how the phone was cutting in between that time. Yeah, I was meditating, it was more, and I'm seeing that there's something about releasing tension. Now, having a good outlet because you're gonna be picking up on this person frustration, okay? It's like a fire burning here now. Okay. They're working very hard not to take it out on you, I feel openly, but like behind the scenes. The thing is, it's funny because you're still feeling it. <laughs> it's like, okay, I gotta go. We said they turned the phone down. Maybe for some of you, I'm seeing something about masturbation. Maybe you even confronted them. And anyway, so there's just too much pressure here building with something, okay. And now they kind of, it's weird because the runner's in reverse. 
is like now when they come forward then you're kind of like looking in a different direction and that is just like extremely triggering to them because in their eyes they're kind of and it, this proves they're not really ready for you right now for it may be if we perceive it like that but this person okay was kind of like she better now take me and now that i'm vulnerable it's like they're not really vulnerable then i mean yeah because now it's like guys i mean they don't even know I, i'm seeing the chaser now it's like you're you're chasing after someone else it seems like you're you're not you're not waiting on them so they're wondering what the hell happened who came in who, who changed the dynamic up no, no 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 something was different back there i thought you were the chaser you're waiting for me to, no 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 but you're not <laughs> i'm seeing something like a, a korean or japanese writing or chinese writing something japanese korean french even for some of you maybe you're posting something like you're, you went to a french coffee shop cafe it's like you're here you're there you're just enjoying your life and it's like what's going on it's like i'm hearing citrus you're drinking on some citrus drink something like a yuzu yuzu yeah, a lemon yuzu just citrus uh, fizzy drink or something like that maybe you posted a picture or something it's like what i'm hearing something about condiments now maybe you uh for example you went to a restaurant and you posted pictures i hear it like this okay now let's get a little further yeah maybe you even had a picture of you somewhere doing something somewhere and this person was just very again i'm hearing triggered <laughs> like they were looking at that like now they're analyzing it for some of you yeah i mean some of you you've started a new a, yeah a new business even ever since you guys broke up and they're just like wait <laughs> okay <laughs> yeah maybe you maybe even are like yeah i'm like more inspired these days maybe you're even doing an interview they're watching you it's like wow okay <laughs> but you know the thing is that i just get that they don't want they don't want it to they, okay i get that they don't want to put this on you even but, but they are kind of even though like if in the back of your mind you have the perspective that she better be there when i am vulnerable finally then you're not ready for her okay and you're gonna protect that energy and she's gonna pick up on it as well okay so yeah I get this energy building of like she better. It's like that's in the second week and the third. In the third week, they will come forward. I see it for some of you. The second, the third, someone's gonna call you up. They're gonna ring you. I see you, something with the numbers dialing it. You're gonna see their their number popping up on your phone, like flashing. Okay, green button, red button. Some of you, I'm seeing something. You, you're gonna be too busy. The timing is off. I see that you're something about Halloween. You're like in the back of like a cab or something. It's like I don't have time to pick this up. Sorry, bye. <laughs> you're gonna be at maybe some some event or some party. I see a leather jacket here we were saying they may send flowers to your door I mean, and i was hearing that song um i was hearing a song by maroon five not going home without you i'm seeing a red a red cadillac i don't think i've ever seen a red cadillac in my whole life <laughs> i see a red i almost said tesla but uh taxi cab right there okay interesting um the runner guys this person this card is shape-shifting it literally jumped time lines. it jumped into the last week on top of the chaser on the magnolia it's like hold on it's like he thought to get a better look in the club wait wait but she's in there right this person gonna come looking for you they're gonna start getting like more and more paranoid i see that for some of you when they cannot get a hold of you in the second or third week oh shoot okay they're, they're, in their mind they believe that you guys are still together so it's like was she cheating on me it's like they see it as cheating okay let's continue permanent uh, we said permanent uh, I was saying we is like they feel like you guys etched your names out okay it's like we wrote it in permanent ink like we're together so anyways for some of you I see an old school car it's like a man when you just just married but like let's say the time that the breakfast the, 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 let's go the around the era that okay films in the era we are saying something about the breakfast club I literally have deleted every goddamn app on my phone so that I have space to record it's insane i gotta get i get i'm gonna get a separate device just for my recordings i can't do this anymore okay spearmint on the peppermint comforting here next to spearmint okay and then we have here i hear i'm hearing something about christmas oh christmas uh halloween but oh i take it as well okay take it as well anyways i'm, I'm for some of you um no, this person gonna have a freak out they're gonna have a meltdown okay i've seen them running across the front lawn i see sprinklers going off i'm hearing something about like i'm hearing the goblins and the ghouls it's like something with halloween maybe you're at a party or something yeah th this person is gonna it's something very they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna split now i'm seeing something maybe for some of you sometimes you feel like you see different sides of this person sometimes this side of them comes out and then at other times like it's like they don't want you to see that side of them so then they kind of try to have a reason for why they act in a story like oh no i was like acting like that because uh i was like uh kind of more of my leo energy you know <laughs> i'm here to like this okay so it's like maybe that is true though maybe maybe you know they don't know even they, they don't they don't understand what they even want with you see that's the thing for some of you whatever the factor is that is 
they're not integrating what they really want out of this experience so maybe they're even saying oh no i want that in this relationship like i just yeah i don't i don't like you like that i just want this with you okay i hear it like this new moon in libra know you are loved so spirit is saying confirming to you because i believe that you do know in your heart space that this cannot be okay for some of you 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 know you shared you shared so much with this person some of you i mean this is the most significant person i feel in your lifetime to this point of watching this video last quarter moon you went through so many experiences i see a, a like a teapot ancient looking wow it's maybe a past life energy a last quarter moon and scorpio reveal what needs to be seen we never ended up saying the breakfast club okay let's get further scorpio this person's gonna have a freak out no they're coming through they, they have to they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna break the chandelier oh my god what i'm hearing um the song chandelier what's the song is it by sia um anyway something with a chandelier the music video has shia labeouf and sia in that cage okay full moon and leo go wild last i'm, I'm gonna hang from the chandelier or something like that okay land last quarter moon and scorpio okay watch out <laughs> what a threat reveal what needs to be seen it's like <laughs> okay you know it's like i see this person like wants to bring the chandelier down i don't know what that's about now they need your attention now it's like excuse me it's like they need your vibe they need your vibe back maybe they feel like your vibe you're giving they're wondering what happened okay so we have full moon and leo new moon and libra it's like you turn the lights down it's like they come home you're not you're not home you're always home though so now it's like there's something kind of strange it's like why the lights are down you know they have to figure it out maybe even or or some yeah they need to they need to feel all right and that's all they know as well it's like all i know is that i want to feel better about this conversation so pisces we're gonna get one card of advice and then we're out of here <laughs> okay please hit the like button on this video if it did resonate for you doing so may really help get this this message out to further viewers youtube looks at how many people like especially within the thir first 30 minutes of watching or so and they will pump the video out the algorithm will expand from then on <laughs> basically more or less um at that point and um this video will reach um you know potentially hundreds more people hundreds thousands even of more people so if you find that this message is helpful for you in some way and you derive some sort of you know uh, enlightenment okay or, or a sense of um let's go in the throat chakra on the back yeah uh, throat chakra the back of the neck let's clear it let's go in the third eye mm -hmm. all the way down the back let's clear all the way down the back um then please uh hit the like button let me know okay as well uh hmm you guys have a past life, something with the army. I see something about someone who was a general. We have love relationships. I'm creating room in my life for my soulmate. I accomplish anything I put my mind to. I face difficult situations with courage Let's go. and conviction. I always find a way out of such situations. Some of you, this is partly a matter of healing and accepting that this person is also wanting a new beginning. We have, my home is a clean, warm, happy place that supports my well-being. And maybe, maybe you don't accept it right now. Yet again, that's where you understand where am I really at? Is it that I'm not ready for this relationship now? Uh, my home is a clean, yeah, warm, happy place. Maybe for some of you, though, yeah, we said something about the lights are down. So, you know, you're finding maybe a temporary home. For some of you, like, that might be literal in the sense of, you know, but also metaphorical. Like, maybe you and this person, they felt like home. And then they saw, like, that you could change that statement a bit, okay? Like, yeah, I mean, no, I'm not... I'm not feeling it. Yeah, there, there are standards. So you're going to do what you need to do to fulfill your happiness, basically, I, you know, is the, is the take a message. Like, if this person is not able to be, you know, also um, respectful towards you or, or appreciating you, then you're going to move on. I eat to fuel my body, and that is your actual, like, in tangible ways. Not just, like, I'm l releasing the energy, but I'm also making tangible movement and change to sort of quantify that. In other words, for example, if I'm saying I don't want to talk to you, I'm not going to call you. I'm not going to text you. I'm not, you know, going to even have you maybe in my phone or I'm not going to, you know, follow you back on Facebook. I'm not going to do those things that I used to do, right? Because sometimes we say, I'm done, I'm done. And then we're like continuing the whole lifestyle still of what it's like to not be done. So, this, you know, it's something that you, there's something that you have cleared, okay, and it maybe is a certain, in a way, commitment for some of you, you really moves on. I mean, honey, yeah. So, um, it's kind of like, yeah, um, but they need to see that, and, and that's very important as well. I said, we lit this card, it says, I set a new standard. Wow. Amazed. Amazed. 
physical health slash body image. I will be productive and energetic today. I eat to fuel my body, not to satisfy an appetite. And then the smallest action can make a difference. My life is important. I can change the world. My life is important. I can change the world just by being here right now. For some, So for some of you, mm -hmm, let's read that one again. My The smallest action can make a difference. My life is important. I can change the world just by being here right now. So let's clear it. Let's back it up. There's something that you haven't done yet in your story. And this is the perfect time to do it. I'm hearing it like this for some of you. Well, this is the perfect time for you. Okay, this person, for them, apparently it's a perfect time to come back and test the waters and see, are, is Pisces still around? Is Pisces still here? Like, I'm back, kind of, like, but maybe not yet. I mean, was Pisces still open? That's not the point. If you are really, truly ready to be vulnerable, you are not going to be testing the waters like that. There's no need to test waters where we are coming from a space of unconditional love, right? Otherwise, it's like saying, I only want to show love if I am guaranteed that this person is not going to reject me. My partner is cheering at the sign of my enormous success on I am creating room in my life, in my life for my soulmate. So for some of you, you may be testing this person back. Like if I tell you that I'm not available anymore, what are you going to do? Because maybe that's the truth. Maybe I'm really not available. So if that's the case and I, and I tell you, hey, I pursued, you know, my standard. I really stuck to that. Okay, and I really actually created room in my life to experience that new standard. And, and, and you know, yeah, and, and I cleared where it is that I was somehow still participating in, in, in a paradigm that wasn't for me. Okay, will you also be happy for me? So thank you for tuning in. We'll see you in the next video. And I'm hearing a song. Um, will you still love me tomorrow? Yeah, um, and in the theme, we have spiritual. My thoughts are positive and optimistic today. So this is, you know... Um, a, a lot of um a, a, a lot of reflection we'll see in the next video i feel like you are testing this person and reflecting and, and vice versa